Hi, welcome to this uh, tutorial. We, this is actually not a tutorial, but it's an impression of Arch Merged i3 WM. So it's a Windows Styling Manager i3 and um, you're looking at it. And this is our uh, website where we'll put all the tutorials and all the articles. We have here a um, possibility to to start Atom, Genie, Sublime Text, any text as you like. And on every um, workspace available, you can run and start applications anyone want. Better like this. This is going to be Melt, FLC, this is VirtualBox, F8 is your Tunar manager, F9 is going to be Evolution, and so on. And not last but not least for me, then, is Spotify on 10. So I have 10 monitors, 10 workspaces, 10 places where I have a complete full screen. Well, not complete, because we have these caps here, and these caps are um, the way we well, make a distinction between what the wallpaper is, for instance, uh, behind it, and what's what we're working on. So, it's design-wise, you know. So, you can have uh, all these uh, elements as well, what you're looking at, Arch Merged, t with a D, uh, is simply installed, then you run some scripts, and then you end up with what you're looking at. All I did is go inside Alex Appearance, and then change some things around, like are darker maybe, an icon theme that you like better, why not Colora Villouette, apply, <clears throat> and you see, you can indirectly see if you like it or not, and stay with it, stick with it. Mouse cursors, if you want the paper mouse cursor and so on, you just select and choose whatever you want here, and other tutorials I've made will change these icons, will show you that Compton makes a shadow and makes a transparency. If you don't want that, you can get rid of it. And what you're looking at actually is that Compton com file that is changed in one of our tutorials, I think number eight or nine. So here it is. You have from Arch Merge team, you start up with an Arch Merged ISO, go to the GitHub, install all the scripts, and then once you've done that, then you start editing and you start changing and you say, I don't want GIMP, I don't want Inkscape, but I do want this application and that application. And you start adding and changing the scripts. Make sure you back up all your work. Best way to do that is on GitHub, but that's up to you. If you want to keep it on Dropbox or anywhere else or on an external drive, all good for us. The advantage of putting it on GitHub is that you can share it with the rest of the world. That's a major advantage for us. So I do hope we'll get some uh, revised, remade, rethemed um, Arch uh, merged i3s. So this is the folder so that you change some of these elements, colors and so on. You change them and then you provide the code for other Arch mergers to use. That would be awesome. That is a dream of mine. All right, so um, that's just a quick overview of what you'll get. It's up to you now to get things going. Download the Arch Merge ISO, start running these scripts, and then listen to my tutorials about 10 or 12, and then you know a little bit more about i3, and it's then up to you to use it and well get it into your fingers because a lot of keyboard shortcuts that are used that i know by head uh, out of my head and my fingers actually know it um, before i i know what i'm doing it's already pressed so have fun with i treats um and a very minimal desktop environment very fast very uh, decent thing to try out and um, spend your time in all right have fun.